I have been using Perplexity AI for the past 6 months. In this video, I am going to share all my tips and tricks to achieve outstanding results. Let's start with asking some questions. So this interface is very similar to ChatGPT and Google search. So here I am going to ask Apple Vision Pro Review. And I am choosing my focus as all. Then click. Now it's searching over the internet. It uses Reddit, it uses YouTube and few other sources. Perplexity AI is an answer engine. So it uses all the searches. Then it summarizes and answer our questions. So now let's say you want to narrow down your search only on YouTube. What you can do is you copy, click new thread. In the focus, you can choose only on YouTube. Here you can paste Apple Vision Pro review. And now it searches only the YouTube and it answers based on that. You can see these are the videos it used. So now let's say you want to remove some video in the answer. What you can do is click this. Here you can see all the sources. Now let's say you don't want it to use this video and this video. You can just click X, then done. Now it rewrite the answer without using those two videos. So you can copy this answer like copy. And if you go to any word document and you can paste it here, you can see the citations that it has used. That's pretty helpful. So now let's say you don't want it to use any of internet sources. You can just choose writing mode. If you are using writing mode, it's same as using chat GPT-4 without using internet. For example, if you ask Apple Mission Pro review, it cannot answer because we are not using any internet. It's just writing mode. It uses GPT-4. Yes, as you can see, it's not using internet now. Now let's talk about their AI companion. You can go here. Click Chrome AI companion. You can install this. Now let's say I want to ask some questions in this page. I can choose this page. Here I can ask questions like what's its battery life? Here you can see the battery usage is two hours on its external high performance battery. Yep, I think it found it from here. It looks very helpful. You can also change this to domain or all. If you use domain, it searches the entire apple.com domain and it uses that to answer the questions. You can see these are the links it has used. I have replaced my Google search with Perplexity AI. You can choose Chrome default search. Here you can install the plugin after installation. You can open any browser and you can paste your question. Now it directly goes to Perplexity AI instead of Google. Now let's talk about collections, which is one of my favorite feature of Perplexity AI. You can click library. Here you can create a new collections by clicking plus. Let's say you want to travel to Japan. You can just type Japan travel. And you can choose any icon, Japan, description, planning a trip to Japan. And this is the most important part, AI prompt. Here you can pass any custom instructions. Let's say I'm interested in staying at Ryokan. I like temples and gardens, onsens, noodles are my favorite. And privacy, you can choose shareable or private. Let me choose shareable, click create. So once it's created, you can go here. Here you can ask any interesting questions related to Japan. Last year I traveled to Japan and I spent nearly hours and hours of research going through YouTube, Reddit and reading their blogs about best places to stay. I watched hundreds of videos and it took a lot of time. Now let me ask best places to stay in Kinosaki. Here it used TripAdvisor, Agoda and a few other websites. Here it's on. Here you can see the answer. This is pretty helpful. This is pretty helpful. It also knows that I like noodles. Here you can see it's mentioned because it's very personalized. Another interesting feature is I can rewrite the answer using different models. Let's say I don't like this answer. What I can do is I can click rewrite. Let's say I want to use Gemini Pro. I can choose this one. I can click Ryokan. Now it uses Gemini Pro to answer. 
which is very helpful with perplexity ai you can upload any pictures or word documents or excel files and ask any questions now i'm going to upload a file i'm going to ask a question what do you think about this youtube thumbnail design this thumbnail i'm going to ask a yeah, feedback it not only answering about this thumbnail it also searches how professional thumbnail looks like then it combines everything and it's giving an answer i find this is super helpful perplexity a also comes with perplexity labs here you can play with recent models for example meta recently launched code llama i can play with it code for binary research here you can see the code immediately which is very helpful here you can also choose different models like mistral medium and few other models perplexity a also has api keys with that you can interact their models using programmatic for example here you can click here click the api if you have a pro version they provide 5 dollars pro bonus and you can generate your own api key once it's ready you can use the api key here you can ask any questions the way it looks like is very similar to open ai so with very few changes you can run their models for example here you can choose base url as perplexity ai and in the model you can choose perplexity ai models and remaining everything is same this client comes from open ai with very few change we can run many models so this code llama was introduced just 2 days ago and within few hours perplexity ai has launched it and i got decent results this is super handy too now let's talk about privacy and customization you can click your profile by clicking here here you can choose a data usage currently by default it's turned on you can choose turn off now let's say you want to add some customization you can click your profile here you can introduce yourself here like things you like your location and few other details then whenever you ask some new questions perplexity ai uses this information and it will be more personalized you can also do similar thing with collections that we have seen previously i hope this is helpful if you like it please consider subscribing to my channel thank you